Hey everybody, this is TR10042 aka Anton from the 501st Legion and today I'm here to show you guys the air conditioning system I have implemented into my helmet. Now what we got here is the standard Ruby's helmet and I've made some modifications on the inside and I'll get to that shortly. But what we have here is the air conditioning swamp cooler handheld unit and I've made some modifications so what we got is the standard body that runs on four AA batteries. I personally have rechargeable ones because this thing, if you're trooping for a couple hours, it, it does suck up a lot of energy. So having at least two or three sets of these as a backup is definitely a plus. Now, the way it works is it runs on a swamp cooling sponge system and this it's it's moist, it's damp and it runs on a graded back so you insert this here you attach it let's get this in there real quick and there you go now the fan on the inside ends up pulling air through the sponge and it semi super cools it so it's, it's getting cooler air and as you can see here it's a pretty powerful um, fan um, uh, it seems I got a leak, but I can patch that up later. Now what I have here is uh, at the top where it normally blows out air, I cut out the vent system and attach these four tubes that I ended up picking at an Ace Hardware store. You could probably get them at Lowe's or uh, Home Depot, anywhere that sells tubes. And they blow out air. You can probably uh, hear it if, if I get it close enough. But having this circulating air into your helmet will save your life if you hate being hot and you hate being all sweaty and uh, trapped in it so this is definitely one of the things I could have used while doing any of my other costumes in the past so uh, the way it works is you know you have it running up into your helmet just like this with it sitting on your back so this will go around your neck and um, very concealable running up into your helmet right on the visor wherever you feel you know the S shape uh, double double nose area whatever you want to do and uh, I'll, let's get to showing you how this thing gets put in so right here I have two velcro attachments which allows me to grip it in and I'm thinking about installing a third one right here on the back to have it firmly secured so it doesn't shake around but right here where it's a little too close to the visor because it's probably gonna block air so I just have to readjust where the air goes um, just sits right there and let's get these bad boys in you can take a quick gander at how this will look all right Put that one right there hopefully you can see pretty well and just like that you'll sit on your back turn it on and boom just starts pumping air in and getting air circulated around your face so you're not muggy hot and sweaty there will be a little sweat because you know some air does get trapped under your, your hair or in the cloth fabric but this will definitely keep you cool for a very good amount of time and when it starts to slow down it does slow down I mean let's turn it down slower that's this is it on its low setting this is it on its high but that air just it's it it feels great when you're trooping and it's just super hot and stagnant well, there you have it. If you want to look into picking one of these up, you know, just go online. eBay is where I got mine. Amazon, too. I got this thing for 10 bucks. If it shorts out, you know, there's not really much to whine about because it's lasted me a couple months. And uh, every time I install this, and I've just gotten around installing it, I, you know, real life gets in the way of trooping. Unfortunately, I would love to have more fun trooping, but I can't. And, um... Yeah, you know, just install it. The reason for the tape is air likes to escape once you plug up these holes. So there are lines around here because this thing is adjustable to move wherever you want it to. Just plug those up. There is a hole opening up right here that I have to fix. And it'll start pumping out 100% air right through these tubes. But uh, any questions or comments that you want to ask, leave them. Uh, below the video and I'll see you about getting back to them. Alright, thanks. Bye.